Alright, so I want to make a quick video on how to create the hitch peg. Down below I'm going to hit this plus. We'll create part studio. Before I begin, I want to change that part studio name. I'm going to right click on it, rename it to label as hitch peg. Alright, and this part is going to be made using the revolve tool. So I'm going to create this kind of checkered shape here and simply revolve it. To do that, I'm going to add a new sketch to my front. I'm going to use my line tool and draw a line that goes up. This 0.65. All right, and then I'm going to draw another line that comes around the bottom half of this distance. So this is a diameter 0.25. I'm going to do a distance of 0.125. Right? Because I'm going to revolve it. My distance going up is going to be 0.5. And then I'm simply going to draw a line any length coming to the right. Right? If I look back at here, you notice I've got a blue dot here. I've got a diameter this circle here is a diameter 0.4. So I'm going to dimension from here to here at 0.2. Again, half of it, right? I'm only drawing half of the circle. Then I'll simply draw a circle or an arc that goes from here to here. And it should allow me to enter that radius. In this case, my radius says 0.208. All right, I'll do that again. I click on arc. It starts here, ends here. And once I place it, I can enter that radius, which is 0 0.208. Get my finished sketch. Go to my isometric view up here to revolve, select my part, and select my axes, as that inside edge. And there's my part.